Praise be to Jesus. Good morning friends. Today, 5th Friday of Kaitha. We remember the martyrdom of Simone and her seven sons. Readings are 2nd Maccabees chapter 7 verses 1 to 9, Acts of the Apostles chapter 7 verses 54 to 60, Gospel of St. Matthew chapter 16 chapter 10 verses 16 to 25. when they persecute you in one town flee to the next saint simone and her sons we celebrate the feast of saint simone and her seven sons the second book of maccabees gives us the account of the persecution of the seven sons and their mother they were fried in frying pans their limbs were cut tons were cut and they were persecuted one after another in front of their mother but they suffered patiently and remained faithful to the law of their ancestors saint stephen chapter 7 of the acts of the apostles give us the account of the martyrdom of saint stephen The first Christian martyr was stoned to death. He boldly witnessed to Christ by suffering patiently and also by praying for the persecutors that they may be forgiven. Matthew chapter 10 verses 16 to 25. See, I am sending you out like sheep into the midst of wolves. So be wise as serpents and innocent as doves. Beware of them, for they will hand you over to councils and flog you in their synagogues. You will be drawn before governors and kings. You will be hated by all because of my name. But the one who endures to the end will be saved. These words of Jesus give us strength to face God. persecutions for the sake of Jesus Manipur Basta Pakistan In Manipur more than 100 churches were burned down In Basta Christians were converted to Hinduism by force In Pakistan several churches were destroyed and Christian houses were burned down this week the christians have faced persecutions and kept their faith in spite of the persecutions christianity has spread giving courage to those who are persecuted for christ let us pray lord jesus today we remember the sacrifice of saint simone and her seven sons we also reflect on the martyrdom of saint stephen and other martyrs who have given us the example of fearless witness to you amen